It's the second day of Boracay's reopening and the island is bracing for the arrival of more tourists. To tell us how things are going on the ground, we have Jenny Dogon reporting live from Boracay Island. Jenny, are you seeing a lot of vacationers there today? Yes, Jovi, more visitors are expected to visit Boracay Island today after opening its ports to tourists from all over the country. Recall that only 26 tourists graced the island, 7 from Metro Manila and 14 from other regions. Ackland Governor Florencio Miraflores attributes this low turnout to strict protocols requiring tourists to have a negative RT-PCR test result 48 to 72 hours prior to travel. But Miraflores... Flores is in phase, insisting that these policies should remain in place because they want a return. GU is trying to avoid the immediate influx of tourists, which will make things difficult to control. Tourism Secretary Bernard Romulo Puyat seconded this, saying they want to reopen the island paradise slowly but surely. For their part, hotel owners promised to offer guests discounts of up to 75% to somehow make up for their customers' swab test expenses. Right now, the top priority of the LGU and DOT is the safety and well-being of both tourists and residents of Boracay. So guests must expect stringent restrictions in the famous tourist destination. Visitors are urged to be responsible, to respect and follow the rules, and to never be too complacent in adhering the minimum health protocols in the island, even on vacation. Meanwhile, Governor Miraflor assured tourists that the appropriate COVID-19 response is in place.